For my presentation today, I will be going in depth into the rise of advertising. And my name is Bruce Smith, and more specifically, I will be defining limited liability. When limited liability was introduced into the business world, what it did necessarily is it gave normal people, such as myself, my classmates, and you, Professor Willett, the a sense of protection or like a protection blanket to secure that our money was was able to be returned if something bad were to happen. Like before, or what it does is it restricts an investor's risk in a business venture to only his or her shares in a corporation. Before, this was not the case. So when this was introduced, what it really did is it, it allowed normal people or other people to get involved with into the business world and into the investment of the business world because it it, it, guaranteed, it almost didn't guarantee, but it, it allowed for wiggle room with your money when you're investing in different companies and different businesses to where you could make a big profit or a small profit at a sustained long period of time. So people who did not know very much about investing in companies and so on and so forth were now introduced into the business world and what investing was and how they could actually make a profit on their money throughout a period of time. Towards the late 1900s, we saw the rise of advertisement take over, and there was four major ways that this took over. Limited to liability was simply just one of them, and that's the area that I'm focusing on. But three other major ways that it also um, developed over over time and really changed our modern era that we're living in right now. The one, the first one being capitalism, which allowed different businesses to compete with for different resources and so on and so forth so we didn't have one company reign strong over another one. We also had the Industrial Revolution which which increased so many different businesses with transportation mainly is what I think of. Like If you look at now our modern era Amazon as to how we get packages within within a day at most times just is incredible to see the, the level which we've come to now. And, and lastly, but not least of the other area, is modern branding, which, which dealt more towards the earlier part of this sort of movement where you had people who were living on farms to now living in cities, and they had a high-level competition due to the immigration rate jumping of whether it be from south border or northern border or wherever, to now there was more competition for these jobs. The ad example that came to mind for me when I was thinking about how does this relate to limited liability to an ad to advertisement is JP Morgan, which is an investment company. And basically in this video, what it is showing is how investing with them, hiring them to invest your money is a safe and secure way so you can worry about the more important things in your life, but at the same time still be able to make money and be able to grow your family and raise a family and be able to support them through your job and actually have something left over for retirement for you and your spouse to be able to live off of. So what limited liability also did, which I have not mentioned, is it created a new area of jobs in my mind in this investment company with where you have businesses along with my father is actually a financial advisor for the NFL. So he deals with these sort of these sort of things and these sort of differences in his everyday life and his everyday world. And I don't know what type of job, what his job would look like if this were not the case. And I think that this was a great example of an ad that JP Morgan has done to be able to show us how we can be comforted in their, in their sort of business and feel safe with our own money in their hands.